Oh. Hello, everybody. Welcome back. After a year and a month and whatever many days it's been, welcome back to Let's Play Yu-Gi-Oh! GX, the beginning of Destiny. Now, as I said in my little update video, I will be showing you how exactly you get a partner. Now, in the video portion of what you're watching now, I will show you how to get Jaden as your partner, and for everyone else, just read the description. Now, for Jaden as your partner, you need him to be at least have the giant heart completed. So that's all except one heart. You don't need that little bit on the final heart, you just need all but one heart. You can fill up the final heart, I don't know exactly what it does, but you don't need to. You just need to get the big heart. Now, again, for anyone else as a partner, read the description. Now, here's how you go about filling up the hearts. Or at least, here's how I did it extremely fast. Let's go in here. Go in here, and you talk to Jaden every day. Skip all that crap. You know, choose any of these. Never choose rumors, like I always say. Alright, you do that. You do that every day. Then you duel him. Then you go buy him a sandwich. You do all of that twice a day. So you do that in the morning. I'm not going to duel him. I'm not going to go out of my way to buy him a sandwich since I've already had full hearts. Now you talk to him. And you would go to school, but we don't. Ha you don't actually have to go to school in this game. Instead, I just remembered. You could just, yeah. You can just advance time to about what is it? Three o'clock. So twelve. One. Two. Three. Okay, it's about 3 p.m. I think that's about when Jaden would be- that's about when school's out, ain't it? Oh, everyone's at school. Yeah, see, everyone's in the classroom. Got emails. Oh, uh, God. Come on, let's see if I can skip past this. It's time... Another hour. There we go. Alright, now it's the afternoon. So, now school's out, you would just go to the store, huh. you'd buy a sandwich again, and you'd talk to Jaden again, and you see that the hearts by his name now, which tells me that he's going to be my partner. Okay, we're counting on you for the tournament, so yeah. But when you get the big heart, really, you can never have a bad talk with him again. As far as I've seen, I haven't had a bad talk with him since uh, I got him as a partner. And plus, you can just pretty much skip to the end of the game. Well, all the way to the end of part one. Then you duel him again and get him another sandwich or whatever. Really, it's that simple, but it's very tedious. You do have to duel him, because dueling him does help your hearts go up. So yeah. Do, do, do. Now let's continue on with the let's play. Ooh, all right. Man's time and the day. Tag Force Meet Me. Today's the day of the Tag Force Tournament. Part one is complete. You'll now return to the title. In the main menu, if you 
if you select story mode, start from part 2 has been added to the list. Select it to enter the tag force tournament. Get your game on in tag force. Warning. You'll be asked to save for clarity part 1. If you choose not to save, your clear data won't be saved and you'll return to your previous save point. So now we go back to the title screen. And yes, you do have to save here. If you do not save, part 2 will not be activated. As the game won't remember that you have beaten part 1. So we're back at the title screen. Press start and press continue. Let it load up your game. And we go to story mode and see, start from part 2. We can no longer continue from our last save point. So, start from part 2. Now, this is where you choose your partner. If you had multiple partners, I guess you could choose your partner. So, let's go with Jason. Now, this is about as far as I've ever gotten in the game, so everything from now on is a surprise to me. Tag Force Meet Date. Hey Ryan, it's time. Looks like they're holding opening ceremonies. Let's hurry up and go. Okay. Go to a ceremony. You're all here. Now then. It's my pleasure to announce the opening of the Tag Team Duel Tournament Tag Force, which is the PlayStation Portable title in this game. Allow me to explain the rules. First, everyone receives 10 GX medals. You'll wager these GX medals in duels. Bet as many as you want as long as both sides agree. The winner of the duel gets the GX medals. If you run out of medals, come to my office. I'll give you 10 more GX medals. If the duel ends in a tie, you get your medals back. You must win to gain more and more GX medals. If you get 90 medals, you enter the final league. The final arena will be here. This arena was specially created for this tourney. Wow, sweet! The writing on that tower, it can't be. Yes it can, Chaz. The Princeton Group is fully sponsoring this tournament. Slade, Jagger, Urgh. we're also beaming this tournament worldwide. This tournament is not just for students. I've also invited duelists from around the globe. My students represent Duel Academy well. Okay, we get the message. Let's get started. Everyone, are you ready? Tag Force, start. So okay, then we just go around dueling people for medals. Chumley is apparently tagged up with Crowler. That's an odd combination. So we have 10 medals. We've got some people here. I guess we do just go around dueling. Let's not start in the classroom. Let's check the map. Whoa! There, we have the new location over here. And, uh, are any other new locations? No? I don't look like it. We do have a new location over here, the special finals there, arena. We'll go there much later. Who do we want to duel? Let's start off checking the harbor. Oh, let's see here. Hey look, it's Jade Slagger. Uh, let's not duel them. Wait, what? Huh, I've beaten Craig before. I only have Tino and Matthew. And if I've beaten him before, let's duel them. Actually, let's go back and save. Just in case. 
Yes. Brightness. And ho hopefully I'm doing this right. That we do just go around dueling people. We have to just get up to 90. And I guess when we get up to 90... It doesn't look like there's a time either. Like, this goes on all day. Like, this is an entire day. We just need to get 90 medals. To enter the finals. So, I guess we don't ever have to go to sleep. Or there's no set end day. Whatever, I've beaten him before, but not when he was tagged up with the other guy. So, let's duel him. Haha, <laughs> I don't mind how many GX medals are we playing for. How does three sound? Sure. Go ahead, Ryan, show me what you're made of. Oh, I got Jaden on my side, even though Jaden's kind of a complete idiot. I mean, I've been... While I was trying to get back up to this point, Jade, whenever I would duel Jaden, he would always keep flipping my weakest monsters into attack position just because there was a monster either face down on their side of the field or because it was weaker. Draw. Screw it, just click scissors again. Yay, we win. And yes, I still like going second. Oh, yeah. I turned off the animations, because it makes the duels go by faster. Plus, I'm pretty sure we've seen all the animations that we need to see anyway. Well, we don't need to, you know. Now, if you want me to turn the back on, just tell me then. Just, just tell me in the comments. I mean, we've pretty much seen every animation. It does definitely make these duels go by faster. Some are even weaker than this. Okay. Yeah. Oh god, not that. I also have that in my deck. Base attack is 2400, and whenever it attacks, your opponent draws a card. Wait, was it ready for this? Alright, so let's set this. Play Hinotama. Ooh, let's see what they got over there. Four, four. The strongest card can still knock my thing out. What, what's the field effect? I increase the attack of all Earth monsters by 500 points. And decrease the Okay. Earth, light, water. Great. Right. Don't have any Earth in my hand. Oh, crap. What am I going to do? What am I going to do? Eh, yeah, I don't like this. Oh, crap. Set a defense barrier. I wonder if Jaden have a attack face down. Defusion. Well, yeah, that's my character. End turn. Activate draw green. Try to draw a card. Ooh, yeah, got Dying Kettle Cure Master. Yeah, we may lose this. I have a feeling you can't really lose this section like you can part one. At least hopefully you can't because, like Chancellor Shepard said, um, whenever you lose all your medals, you just go to him. And hopefully he doesn't just tell you you lost. Okay, so let's play down to the Cure Master. Ooh. And summon the Bistro Butcher. And play H Heated Heart. Fuck it for the Bistro Butcher. Why? Because H Heated Heart allows me to attack a defense position monster and still do damage to his life points. Yeah, they draw two cards whenever I do damage to the life points. End turn. Call the Haunted. Oh god. We're almost dead. Keep it to burial. 
That was kind of a way 